The beauty of Alaska is just being able to experience the outside. Definitely a highlight would be the glacier stops. Uh, on our particular run, we do Hubbard Glacier, which is magnificent. We have amazing excursions up here. We've got so many different adventures to do. We've got something for everybody, whether it's just like a bus tour or if they want something energetic where they can go and um, have a bit of excitement. Woo! Yeah! Canadians will be coming and joining the Rhapsody of the Seas. And of course, the ship came out with uh, quite a few enhancements uh, straight after dry dock, which basically makes it really an incredible uh, vacation experience for our guests. What Royal Vantage really stands for is that every ship becomes our best ship. The revitalization strategy really is about making sure the guest has a consistent experience, no matter which of the 22 ships in the fleet they come on and that they can expect standardized offerings. Rhapsody's special ship on our fleet has been for a long time, doing a wonderful service, of course, in both Alaska and Australia. When I really think about Radiance class, they, they really are some of my favorite ships in the fleet. We call them the ships of light. And to me, I almost think that they're almost yacht-like and they give the ability, they're very destination intensive ships. The Setchum has always been the heart of the ship on our Vision and Radiance clan ships, but now we've reinvented it and we really turned it into a, into a theater. We have created a, a brand new theatrical space on the ship, a second theatrical space on our Vision and Radiance class ships. To get a facelift of this magnitude and lift it up in the eyes of the customers who are there is special. When you can go up to the uh, to the Hubbard Glacier and, and enjoy that, uh, that's something that we just can't offer anywhere else. I, I think that is the best way to explore Alaska. You get to experience it with the comfort of a cruise ship.